We already are losing clubs, you know, because of what's happening with the internet. We're already losing a lot of the spirit that is rock and roll and stuff. And local radio still has the power to put out what they want, you know, community radio. So they play whatever they want to, which right. is like the best thing. They're not paid to play certain music and it would be a shame to lose it. It would be just another notch shredded from like a, a band that really works hard and music and yeah, you know, there's so many great things about the internet and technology and stuff, don't get me wrong, but uh, they're taking away the heart. It's just too accessible. When talking about, you know, trying to reach out or discover new music on the radio that that the TV isn't playing, that the internet isn't doing, you you know, you get to hear other people's interests and in, in what's going on. And then giving bands a chance to get on and play live and, you know, talk about locally what's happening, you know. Right, connect, connecting locally and, and, and radio's the best way to do it. Uh, and it's always reliable, you know, so it's... It's just, it's great to have it, and, and especially for local bands, especially just for young people, too, to discover new music. Uh, we need diversity. There's not enough diversity in the regular commercial radio. Uh, notice in community radio, they, they don't have any, any sort of boundaries. It's, uh, they can show anything from uh, local groups to nationwide, international, <clears throat> excuse me, music from different nations, different countries, and it's, it's great to have that. Yes, it was on uh, KSYM, um, they played our, our song, uh, An Encuentro, it was, uh, it's, it was very cool, I've never heard ourselves on the radio, and you know, it, it being a band, being a musician, I guess you're always like, you know, that's what this, the whole thing is about, you, you push to that, that moment where one day you get to hear yourself on the radio now. There's a local station, you know, college radio, but still, that was like our night, and so now, you know, I'm hoping to do that again pretty soon, so yeah, it was pretty, pretty, pretty great. I think we recorded it, to be honest with you, so. <laughs> we'll hear it every now and then again. When I first heard myself play on the radio, it was actually we were able to perform live on the radio rather than our record being played, because we, one of the, another college radio station, Trinity, KRTU, 91.7, they had a, every week they would have one live local band featured and the best part about that was I thought it would be really hard to get onto it but all it was was an email getting quick access to it. It's very personal. I would contact them and the director would contact me and I was able to get our high school band at the time I saw it on the local feature. Typically uh, at our level when, you, when you're going to be on the radio you know ahead of time so you're playing out and you're sitting there waiting for it and you, you call your friends, friends and, and, and they, make an evening out of it. You get excited, something to look forward to. Yeah, definitely really exciting. But here, uh, unfortunately, we only get to do that after midnight on the you know the main radio station. In town. The radio, the people, like if you really want to get into talking about something like the digital divide and how there's a lot of people that don't have any like access to the internet and finding out all sorts of information up to date you know at the moment information the radio is like a really big resource even for families that don't have TV so having good local radio is important for other things besides just music it's good for finding out the news your weather your traffic report things that are really important uh, for every day working citizens just to know about especially if if something really uh, huge happens so without a good radio station that's local and concerned about what's happening in the community, it's not going to get uh, communicated as well. And that, that can cost lives in the end in certain places. And if you don't have a connection between the community and the community's radio station, then there's, there's, there's going to be some you know, glitch in the system that's going on. It's not supposed to happen. The community and the radio station, the airwaves, is all supposed to be tied in together because the, the airwaves typically or you know essentially belong to community members it's really important for us to maintain that connection there should be a there shouldn't be a gap in between the person and their airwaves so you need people to to be aware of it so that they know why they need to support it i think that's really the key to it all